Photography is a tool, uh, is a language of art, and through the photography I decided to go to Turkey to start a kind of research and a kind of understanding about what happened. Uh, it was in 2012, my first trip uh, to Turkey or to historical Armenia, and then the facts start to happen, the meetings start to happen, and it became a project. I was not expecting to find uh, the, the Armenians that I found in Turkey and the Turkish people that I found, the Kurdish people that I found. Uh, if we had the pain, they have the guilty. So it's not easy to carry a pain that you didn't suffer, because I didn't suffer, my grandfather suffered. As the Turks and Kurds of my generation, they didn't have the guiltiness of the genocide, but they carry also the guilty. is located on two levels of the historic library, the Davini Library. Um, the first uh, sort of scene of it is in the treasure room, and it's a, uh, it's called the treasure room for good reason. It's a kind of um, historic wood paneled room with a narrative frieze at the top. And so our engagement with it had to be very carefully curated because we could not really um, remove or reconstruct any of the uh, you know, edifices in there. And so that is where the kind of, I guess, meeting of these two worlds happens. The two worlds being the contemporary images, the contemporary photographs taken by Norard and the um, dioramas of the historic postcards. The second portion of the exhibit is downstairs and it's largely comprised of a series of postcards, the, the postcards themselves. And so it's um, a kind of visual timeline of the postcards and the vitrines where the uh, exhibit goer can just kind of move around and see these postcards categorized in um, different visual cataloged themes. It's really good how photography can connect and can tell a story. You know, we are kind of storytellers. Uh, we talk with uh, photography and it's the same language of 100 years ago when people photograph to deliver the postcards to the ones who they miss or they love uh, through the photography. And it's the same way that I'm doing now 100 years ago, sharing these images of now the same places.